Valerie, it says I'm live. Yay! Yay! <laughs> hey, everybody. Hi, I'm Becky from Power Tools with Thread. And this is our monthly Sunday Live where I'll go over some new products that are on the market and some goodies that have made their way into my sewing room. And we just generally have a good time here and hang out for a little while. So if you are new to my channel, hi, welcome. Please use a Google account to log in on YouTube and pop into the chat and let us know if this is your first time. Everybody is welcome here. Or if you're not logged in, you can leave a comment below. So, well, I think they want you to be logged in to leave a comment. I think you have to do that too. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we've got some hashtag power tools going on. I'm going to get to that in a second, but I want to uh, everybody to say hi to Valerie. She is here with me today. Nobody's there. There we go. <laughs> I've got to figure out which camera is doing what. So anyway, uh, yes, we are going to do a couple of amazing giveaways today. I mean, amazing giveaways. So a dear, dear friend and fan of the channel is Linda Sunny Fox. She is a retired Master Chief Petty Officer. That's an E9 for those of you that were not in the Navy. And uh, she ha has uh, come down with another cancer diagnosis and just underwent some major, major surgery. And so I need all of my prayer warriors out there uh, to give big prayers for Linda Fox uh, to be healthy and strength for her husband because he's going through it with her. So when Linda was here a couple of years ago, she came into my studio and she did a tutorial on how to make key fobs. And she makes them all the time for people. And uh, she did a great job on that little tutorial. But one of the things she did when she was here was she gave me something to give away to you. So in honor of Linda Fox, we have a giveaway for all of my embroiderers out there. So this is the Anita University book 502. It is brand new, never been used. And she gave me this to give to you. She actually won this. And I think she already had one or something. I don't know. So uh, we are going to give this away. Now, there are two different giveaway codes today. And it's this one is hashtag power tools EMB for embroidery. And if you're not an embroiderer, the other giveaway I'm going to do is a brand new pattern from It's So Emma from the Fat Quarter Shop. And this is called Early Bird Quilt Pattern. And this pattern makes a crib, a lap, a twin, and a queen. And I'm giving it away with a sanctuary layer cake from uh, the Three Sisters for Moda. Isn't that gorgeous? So this is for you quilters. And the Anita University is for you embroiderers. Y'all, this, this retails about $250. So very, very generous of Linda to give it to me, to give to you. And I think she's watching and I'm sure she would love to see who wins it. You can enter both, but you can only win one. Okay. So if you want to do both, just do hashtag power tools EMB for the embroidery one. And you can put a space or do another chat comment. You can do hashtag power tools just for the quilting one. So we've got prizes for everybody today. Uh, U.S. shipping only, please. So just wanted to share that with you guys. Very, very excited about that. Power tools is all one word. So don't, not power tools with thread, just hashtag, which is the little pound sign, power tools, all lowercase, and that will work, okay? So uh, be sure, don't put any spaces and don't put power tools with thread. All right, let's get into what is coming into the sewing room. No, let's get into something that's more fun. I'm going to be doing a sew-along 
uh, with your embroidery machine using what I call my snaplique method. And snaplique is where you can do applique in a snap and you can scan in a paper pattern into your uh, scan and cut and then use that digital file to not only cut out the fabric for you, but also import that into machine embroidery software and then convert that into an applique design. So you literally can make what started out as a quilt pattern and turn it into an embroidery pattern. And I am so pleased to say that I have partnered up with Amy Bradley Designs. I love Amy Bradley. Yeah, she's the one who made the quilt diva, right? <laughs> but I have partnered up and I uh, want to thank Amy Bradley Designs so much for uh, doing this with me. So this is Happy Halloween. This is just adorable, okay? And the background quilting that you see behind in the blocks, Designs by Juju. Julie from Designs by Juju is creating the background quilting for the blocks and the Happy Halloween block and all of the sashing and the borders. So that should be ready sometime in April. I also got Two Chicks Quilting to kit the fabric for me. And you guys uh, sold that out. And then you sold it out again. And they added more. And you sold it out again. So this is going to start on April the 8th. And it will run through the 18th or 19th or so. While I am on Sew and Sale 14 with Julie from Designs by Juju. So you guys are going to get lots of content while I am floating around somewhere in the Atlantic. <laughs> so that's going to be in May. I've got a blog post below for that. And if you would like to make it, you can look at that. It gives you a list of all of the supplies that you need. And as more kits become available and fabric kits, those will get replenished on the Two Chicks Quilting website. If you are not into making Halloween quilts, uh, Amy Bradley Designs has also given me permission to do this with their Merry Christmas quilt. So I do plan on making this quilt sometime, probably August, early September, and I will be using my snaplique method again. I may just do this one on a live, but these are going to be pre-recorded step-by-baby-step videos so that you guys can learn the snaplique method and make your own quilts in your embroidery uh, in your embroidery machine. If you have uh, a big fancy machine, then you're going to be able, you know, the kind with a camera or whatever. Uh, I'm also going to show you how to stitch in like Mr. Kitty Cat's whiskers right here. See that cat? I don't get you from the glare there. And he's got in the corner and he's got whiskers. Okay your embroidery machine can make that if you've got one. So it's, if you've got one that can create digital stitching. So it's going to be a lot of fun. I'll also show you how to do that in your embroidery software. This is great. If you've got a scan and cut, you haven't taken it out of the box, you're a little intimidated by it, or maybe you have a, a, a embroider, you have a sewing machine with an embroidery module and you've never used that either. So this is going to, uh, teach you new skills for 2024. And uh, it is a game changer when it comes to applique. You no longer have to stitch around applique pieces on your domestic machine. So it's going to be a lot of fun. The smallest hoop size that you can do with this will be a six by 10 hoop. Okay. So looking forward to that very much. I just wanted to make you guys aware of that. All right. So Let's talk about quilting for a little bit. Uh, Coriander Quilts, that is the blog for my favorite pattern designer, uh, Cori Yoder. She put out a Scrappy Bunny block. If you are not a subscriber to her blog, uh, take a look at that. She's got different blocks for each month, and these are free. So if you are a beginner quilter, they're not real big. And this is just adorable. You can make an adorable, cute little quilt with these blocks, but these are free patterns. I just wanted to let you guys know about that. And now through April 10th, Legit Kits, which is all about paper piecing, is doing a block of the month called Deep Dive. This is Deep Dive with that turtle, okay? You can use coupon code Keith Dive 
That's K-E-I-T-H. That's my husband. You can use Keith Dive for 15% off your first month. And that code is good through April 10th. And the block of the month starts shipping out on uh, sometime in uh, May, I believe. So there's a link below in the description box to the block of the month. And I think you guys are going to love it. This is going to be very cool. I don't think Keith is going to sew it. He is in the middle right now of Sculliver. And so he's already made Autumn the Fox and the Eagle. And he's going to make, uh, he's making Sculliver right now. Then the Buck is next. And after that, he's doing Ursula Minor for me, which is the cute little baby polar bear. I'm excited about that. So his quilt list is quite long right now. So, all right, good. Um, I got in some new fabric from the Fat Quarter Shop. This is a 54 inch, I think. It's a new Lori Holt. I got a couple of yards of this because I thought this would be adorable on my ironing station. What I have on there right now is a light aqua and white. And don't you know, within two weeks, it had scorch marks on it. That's just the nature of an ironing station, right? But I thought this one would look a lot better. It feels like a canvas. And so this is great. I got that. And then I'm also in the middle of making all of the little monthly quilts. Oh, let me get those because I don't mean to step out of camera, but I will uh, quickly. I'm making all of the little monthly quilts. This is from uh, Nancy Halverson's on Wander Lane. And I'm doing these live in our situation room. So Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. Central. I sit at my sewing machine, nothing fancy, you guys, and just poke around and do whatever. Or I'll hit the scan and cut and I walk you through this whole snap process. But I want to get you in here and take a look and see how cool this is. So the fabric was cut on the scan and cut. The Hoppy Easter was digitized by my Luminaire and the little grass lines and whatnot. And then the eggs and everything were stitched down using Embrilliance Stitch Artist 3 just by scanning in that paper pattern. Look how perfect that is. You guys, this changes your world when it comes to, this is snaplique. It changes your world when it comes to doing applique quilts and you can be done in like no time. It's so fun. So I'm wanting to get all these done. So I've been buying the fabric from Nancy Halverson's line. And I want to thank Nancy Halverson at Art to Heart. Uh, she has given me permission to do this and show you guys how to do the snaplique method. So you don't even need to buy pre-cut pieces. Now, if you do buy, uh, <laughs> I was like, what is that? If you do buy pre-cut applique pieces, like a lot of times there are uh, quilt shops that will sell them pre-cut. You can do this, the same method. You can scan in your pre-cut pieces into a scan and cut. And it will also, that, that the shape that it finds will digitize that shape. So I've been doing that, you guys. You guys need to check it out. It is so much fun. Oh, I've got a Band-Aid. I don't know if you guys can see it. Got a Band-Aid. Uh, I suffered a dog bite and uh, spent four days in the hospital in Shreveport. And the Christus uh, Hospital in Shreveport was fantastic. Really, really enjoyed that. Uh, I didn't enjoy it. The, the care was wonderful. Let me put it that way. Even had to have surgery. But I'm getting my stitches out tomorrow and I got to go see an orthopedist. But I got some Get Well cards from y'all. And you guys are so sweet. Look at this one from Sherry. Isn't that just adorable? Sherry sent me this. She's so fun, a little dog with Band-Aids. <laughs> this is so nice with a nice message inside. And then I got this one is from Deb. And Deb, I want to thank you. That's just a beautiful embossed card. It is so, so pretty. So thank you for that. And I also got this one. It's a really cute one. This is from Kathy Ann. And it says, just a spot check. <laughs> very, very nice. And there was another one that came in and I think it got buried here somewhere. Oh, here it is. I think this is it right here. Yeah. And this came in from Rhett. Rhett, thank you so much for your sweet card. You guys, it just lifts my spirit so much. I appreciate that. Okie doke. Got that. I want to let you guys know about that. So, oh, I was on the topic of on Wander Lane 
and I did get in a bunch more fabric. She uses um, a line called Whisper Weave from Benertex, and this came in. And I want to show you guys how nice this is. These are wonderful little uh, fabrics for backgrounds on your uh, blenders for your, your blocks when you're going to be doing applique. So this is a really pretty kind of a blue gray. It's very, very nice. And here's a rose. Very pretty light pink. We've got like a mustard yellow. And here's a real pretty light green, kind of a mint. Very nice. And this is a very light gray. I love these. Whisper Weave is the name of this. This one is the almost, almost a white. Let me get this. There you go. Almost a white. Here's kind of a pumpkin. So I am ready to go now with On Wander Lane and be making these mini quilts. This is the lighter um, orange. <clears throat> And here's a tan. So these are these are awesome. Let me back out a little bit here. So uh, <clears throat> I am ready to go. I have both on Wander Lane one and two fat quarter bundles. Do I need Stitch Artist Two for Snaplique? So you can do it with Stitch Artist Two. That is an brilliance module. Stitch Artist Two allows you to import the vector graphic. Mona, thank you so much. You are so sweet. I appreciate that. Um, Mona gave me a super sticker. There's a little dollar sign below the chat, and it allows you to show your appreciation for the content. So thank you, Mona. That's very thoughtful. Um, you, you would need Stitch Artist 2 at least because that is the module that allows you to import those vector graphics from the scan and cut. Uh, Stitch Artist 3, which I just purchased, allows you to fix broken uh, vector graphics. And that's probably like Greek to a lot of folks, but I explain it in our Situation Room videos, which you can always catch on replay as well. Okay, so got that going. Don't forget you guys, I have got a giveaway for both our quilters and our embroiderers. You can um, enter for both, but you can only win one of them. So for our quilters, we have Sanctuary by Three Sisters for Moda and a early bird pattern from It's So Emma. I think that is just gorgeous. And those are going to look beautiful together. Okay. And then for you embroiderers, courtesy of Linda Sunny Fox, who's a master embroiderer. Um, so you would put Power Tools EMB if you want to win Anita Good Designs. Uh, Anita University, and it is book 502. So it's all about in the hoop. Thank you guys so much, uh, Liesl and Laura. Um, I don't want to miss those. It was Laura. Thank you, Laura, so much. And Liesl, appreciate you guys. That's very thoughtful. That's going to get me some more embroidery stabilizer. Yay! Speaking of embroidery stabilizer, if you have an eight by 12 hoop and you're going to be doing this happy Halloween quilt with me, you're going to want to get more stabilizer. So this is a 15 inch roll. I buy it on Amazon. I've got a link below. It is the new bro thread stabilizer. It's in my Amazon store. And I really like this. I've been using it for years and years. They have it in 15 inch and they have it in 12 inch. So I've got links to these in the blog post as well on powertoolswiththread.com. Hey, Connie. Do what? Connie. Thank you, Connie. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. <laughs> Y'all are coming in quicker than I can take your... Valerie, what have you been doing? <laughs> you guys are so wonderful. Thank you so much. Speaking of Valerie, let me... Oh, well, well, hold on. I'm still on one thing. See, you guys, I'm like squirrel. Okay. Because she did something really cool, and I want to share that with you. We'll do that at the end while we're waiting for people to get in their little last-minute entries. Okay. Thank you, Cheryl. Oh, Cheryl, that's so thoughtful. Cheryl has been with me almost five years that I've been on. Uh, I started live streaming a year ago this month, and I started the Situation Room in August. 
so which is a daily. So um, you guys have been around forever. I have such a wonderful, loyal group of watchers or viewers. And so I really appreciate that. So about a year or so ago, Dime put out, Designs and Machine Embroidery put out these boxes that are uh, like uh, dispenser boxes for your stabilizers. Very cool. You can just pull it across and it has a cutter that works great. You just have to, let me point this down a little bit here. It works great. And you just, you know, pull it across and it cuts great. Well, they just put out a box large enough for your 15 inch uh, long stabilizer rolls. These are nice because they stack nice and you just, there you go. And it cuts your stabilizer so nice and cleanly. Uh, I really like that. So I turn mine on its side like this and then I just stack them in my cubby hole and I will put a sticker on it and it will tell me what it is, which I really like. And I also have a sticker on the end. So that lets me know what box is what and what's in each one. And I stack them in my cubby. So it's just a nice way to be able to organize your stabilizers because the rolls, they change size as they get smaller and they wobble and fall all over each other. So these are really, really good. I'm gonna set these down. Oh, goodness. Okay, uh, let's see, Fat Quarter Shop came out with a bunch of new patterns, and I want to share those with you guys. Uh, these first couple, not only, what will, will that cut the no-show mesh? Yeah, Dave, that's exactly what I just cut with that 15-inch uh, box. So that's, that's exactly what it was. Where did my little piece go? I threw it down. That was no show mesh. Yeah, it cuts paper and no show mesh. So here we go. I'm going to pull this in a little closer. And when I get in close, y'all don't look at my wrinkles, okay? Thank you, Tiny. You're so sweet. Thank you. <laughs> so this is cross trainer quilt pattern. This is an adorable little baby quilt. It finishes at 42 and a half. And it has got uh, the hard copy. You can get a PDF download or they have. Um, and they're coming out with a kit for it that you can sign up for if you want to, to do a kit. Here is Honey Crisp. This is another adorable little baby pattern. Okay, it finishes at 38 and a half square. And they have hard copy, download. This is at the Fat Quarter Shop. So hard copy, a down the PDF download if you want. And they are coming out with a kit for that. And the last one they've got a kit coming out for is Color Me Crayons Quilt Kit. Let me back out just a little bit for this one, okay? This one finishes at 57 and a half by 76 and a half, and it is good with a jelly roll and some background yardage, okay? And um, they are also coming out with a kit for this. So if you, this is great for a beginner. What a fun little quilt. If you are a beginner quilter, this is great. Look at, this is what it's gonna look like right here. That's adorable. This is a perfect quilt for a tween. I love this. So you could do this one in these pretty bright colors for a girl. You could do them in black and white and grays or blues and deep reds for a boy tween quilt. This is a great pattern for tweens. I think that's, they're hard to shop for and make things for, right? I know tweens are bad. Okay. They've got a new one, this is really pretty, it's called Peppermint Bark. And they did it, while the title sounds Christmassy, they did it in an orange and a black. So really you could do it in red green, you could do it in red blue for patriotic, and you've got orange and black. It has a crib, a lap, a twin, and a queen. And this uses yardage. We have poinsettias, another Christmas title that they did in mauves. So this uses yardage as, as well. And it finishes at 54 and a half by 69. This is poinsettias. The next one is Chantilly. What company is this again? Lisa, Lisa, this is from the Fat Quarter Shop. I've got links below and I've listed each one of these patterns and you can just click on it. Okay. So if you are looking for, was it that for Color Me Crayons? This is designed by Jocelyn Yang uh, for It's So Emma by the Fat Quarter Shop. And this is the Chantilly quilt top. It makes a table topper, a lap, a twin, and a king. 
that king finishes at a hundred and a half. Beautiful, beautiful quilt if you wanted to make a king size quilt. Okay, just gorgeous. And the last one that came out this month is Daisy Patch. This is very cute. It uses yardage. Okay, and it finishes at 57 and a half by 72 and a half. So very pretty patterns they've got it that have come out. Okay, love this. That one kind of looks like a little bit of a daisy chain thing, right? Very neat. Okay, I don't want to miss anything from you guys. So I'm always afraid. Stuff gets buried here. It's crazy. Uh, I wanted to let you know, connecting threads, I've cut off the top of my head, connecting threads in honor of National Quilt. Uh, it was National Quilt Day yesterday. So connecting threads is doing a giveaway of a handy quilter sewing machine, not a long arm, but a sewing machine, oodles of thread. Will there be a, a fabric kit for the Merry Christmas quilt? JD, I think there will. I think there will. I did speak with the girls at Two Chicks this week about it, and uh, they're digging around and looking for um, new uh, fabrics to put in for that. And we just went over a thousand people watching, and I am so honored. I'm going to start crying. <laughs> you guys, that is amazing. Thank you so, so much. Hit the thumbs up while you're there and consider subscribing. We can spend more time together. Okay. So in honor of National Quilt Day, they're going to do this giveaway and I they're going to pull the winner on April 2nd. So I think you have up until then to uh, go and try that. No purchase is necessary. Hop over to Connecting Threads. They posted it on their Facebook page and their Instagram. So they may not have it on their on their um, their website. They might. I looked for it yesterday. I didn't see it. But I did see it on the Facebook and their Instagram. Okay. I'm just over 71,000 subscribers right now on my YouTube channel. And I am just tickled pink. And uh, I want to thank Mona. She is a viewer with us. And... Um, she is giving me a license for density repair kit in a brilliance to give away to you. So thank you very much, Mona. You are so very thoughtful. So I'm going to give this away when we hit 72,000 subscribers. So that will be very cool to do. And then I have another giveaway that's going to come up when I hit 75,000 subscribers. You guys um, I want to thank my girlfriend's quilt shop for sponsoring this giveaway. It is Kimber Bell's Quilting Through the Seasons Ladder Quilt. This thing is amazing. It allows you to switch out panels in a quilt that you make on your embroidery machine. Let's see if I can get it out. I don't think I can get it out of the bag without wrecking the bag, and it's it's too nice. So they have sponsored the uh, Kimber Bell's Quilting Through the Seasons Ladder Quilt, the Pattern Book, okay? And they have sponsored the Quilting Through the Seasons Fabric Kit. The fabric is just absolutely gorgeous. I'm not gonna take it out, but I will show you guys all of the fabric that comes in this fabric kit. You guys need to share my channel with your quilty friends and your embroidery friends and your guilds and all of that and get them to subscribe because when I hit 75,000 subscribers, I'm going to give this away. Also, they sent me Quilting Through the Seasons Embellishment Kit. So thank you so much, Patty. That is so nice. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. You're a sweetheart. So you guys, this is about a $300 prize that I'm going to give away for making it to 75,000 subscribers. Hopefully we can do that, you know, this summer sometime. Hopefully we'll do that next week, but I'm not going to hold my breath. <laughs> so I've got a really, really good one coming up when I hit my 100,000 mark. You guys are going to fall over. I've got it in my head already. You just wait. Okay. So speaking of Kimber Bell, I am in the middle of working on with you guys each month the mini quilts. So I am doing that. This is the cute one we did for March. Happy St. Patrick's Day, everybody. I've got my green 
watch band on with my clovers on it, okay? So this is a lot of fun. If you're brand new to machine embroidery and or you've got an embroidery arm and you haven't used it, join me on this. And it's on my blog, powertoolswiththread.com. And you can click on the calendar tab and that will tell you when we are going to put all of these together. Okay. So this is so cute. And we are doing this one right now that has the little eggs in it with the uh, chicks that says you're a good egg and or the bunnies. And I did two blocks. I've got to get some more done because we're going to finish these up Tuesday or Wednesday. Y'all my life. Oh my goodness. So here's the bunny block that we did. And this is all about reverse applique. Isn't that cute? Here's the chocolate rabbit. So adorbs. Oh my goodness. They always send you in these embellishment kits all kinds of new um, things to play with and work with. And it's a lot of fun to learn those. But they have the very best instructions in the industry. And I will take you through these step by baby step uh, when I stitch these out. So it's a great little free Kimberbell class if you want to learn how to do anything on your embroidery machine. And you don't have to have a brother machine. They're all pretty much the same. So, you know, it's just clicking buttons till you figure it out, right? So let's talk about monthly subscriptions, shall we? You guys, I love going over these with you. They're always a lot of fun. Okay, so I'm a huge fan of Villarosa Designs Pattern Club. They have got a club where you, it's $8.95 a month and you get five quilt patterns. And then if you join in, get the table runners, it's an extra $1.75 a table runner. So $8.95 for five patterns is great because these are these little uh, four by six cards. And these normally sell in the quilt shops for two to $2.25, $2.50 sometimes. But um, you can get these, or I think you can also get the download if you want to do that, I believe. I don't want to misspeak. Okay. So these are the ones that came out for this month. This is Regent Park. Let me zoom in for y'all. Beautiful, beautiful Regent Park. As you can tell, it looks like they got a hold of a whole bunch of cave fabrics for this one. It finishes at 54 by 70 and it uses 13 fat quarters. This is a great quilt for a beginner quilter. Look how simple that is. It's just straight line stitching. This is a great pattern for this, okay? The next one that they have is Rhiannon. Rhiannon uses eight fat quarters or 15 fat eights, and it finishes at 45 by 54. Again, a very good quilt. Easy, easy, no diagonal seams if you are a beginner quilter. The next one is Adobo. Adobo uses focus fabric, okay, main fabric. It's got some sashing in it, and you've got some flying geese in there. This is Adobo. It finishes at 50 by 60. This is great if you had plans with a panel. You said, oh, let me make some placemats, and that never happened. Well, now you can make a quilt out of it, so that's cool. Here is Eclipses. This is very cool. It looks like round quilting, but it is not, and it uses um, 15 fat quarters and background fabric. And it finishes at 59 by 75 eclipses. Another great tween quilt. Another one. We have Sparkle Stripes. Sparkle Stripes is perfect for all of our patriotic holidays coming up. This has an applique pattern on the back. There is a star right here on the back. And uh, you can make star with your scan and cut and cut them out. Okay, just get it to the same size. And it just uses red, white, and blue fabric. And it finishes at 62 by 82. This is Sparkle Stripes. Okay. The next one is placemats. This is the Shamrock placemat. And it finishes at 8 by 14. And the uh, yardage requirements on this will make two of those. Very cute Shamrock snack mat. And then we have Perfect Trio. And I like this. This is crazy, crazy simple. And it finishes at 16 by 48, a nice little table runner. So this is perfect trio. Great use of focus fabric that you don't want to cut into. I love this. This is just beautiful. Okay. So speaking of Villarosa Designs, 
they have a wonderful uh, pack that you can get. And it is for Quilts of Valor. You will get 12 patterns of Quilts of Valor for $14.95. That's 12 quilt patterns for $14.95. Like a buck 75 piece, if that, dollar 25 a piece. And part of the proceeds will go to Quilts of Valor. So if you've been wanting to sew a Quilt of Valor, maybe you've got a lot of red, white, and blue fabric. Um, they're very particular about sizes. So these patterns have been approved. They've partnered up with Quilts of Valor. And I'll let you see, a lot of them use panels, which is wonderful. So if you've got some patriotic panels, I think five of these use panels. So it's very, very nice to get 12 patterns for $14.95. And you are supporting the Quilts of Valor Foundation in the process. So that's very, very nice. All right. So there's that. I love that monthly subscription. The next one is the Me Time uh, Collectible Christmas has come in. And Collectible Christmas, where do they get the boxes with the top slicer? Brenda, there is a link below. It's Designs and Machine Embroidery. And this one is to make this gorgeous, gorgeous star on this panel of the Christmas tree skirt that they're making. This is Sing Noel and this is Oh Holy Night. They're doing them all on the uh, Christmas Carol theme. So there is, this is the little ornament that you'll make and there is what it will look like when you make the wedge of the skirt. So in each month you get a little packet that comes with it. And that is your embellishments. Let me make sure I got everything. Yes, I got everything. And you get a wedge of the tree skirt and you're going to get all of the little embellishments that go with it. So if you're sitting around thinking, I got nothing to do with my embroidery machine, they will definitely keep you busy. You are going to get a collectible Christmas USB, which is very nice. You can keep all your designs in one place. And then all kinds of little embellishments that come with this. We've got some pretty little charms that you can put on there. And then let me back out a little bit here. Here is the Christmas tree skirt wedge, and you just stitch it right on here. It's very cool, okay? And it comes with all of the things that you need in order to make your little ornament as well. Puffy foam and all of that. So definitely gives you something to do, and you do it all year. And they, you don't have to, you know, you can go back and get other ones that you might have missed, so that way you're not uh, stuck. And then it does come with, a full color instruction booklet to tell you exactly step-by-step step, how to make your wedge. So that's very nice. Along with uh, the collectible Christmas, there is Perfectly Pieced. And Perfectly Pieced is very cool. Each month you get um, a design and some goodies in the box and some thread. And they tell you um, how to do, it's like piecing in the hoop is what it is, essentially. So for March of 2024, uh, you've got these beautiful, beautiful fabrics. I want to show you guys. These are so pretty to make this month's, I went the wrong way. There we go. So we have a beautiful blue with some little stars on it and a navy blue. And there is a pretty, like a mint aqua blue kind of very pretty these are so cute these little ditzy flowers are just adorable there we have it looks like a that reads as a stripe there and then we've got a beautiful floral with a mix of the blue and that aqua color okay and the thread that came in this month's is called let me get i don't know my, my glasses are on top of my head cool mint just gorgeous I love glide thread. This is so pretty. You also got a uh, pin that shows you what the block is going to look like if you make them all together. You can make four blocks and that's what it'll look like. It's a drunkard's path, I'm pretty sure, is what that's going to be. You got a um, pocket guide to Schmetz needles, which is very nice. These are very handy. What are you going to sew? What needle do you use? What's going to work with what? So these are great. And you also got an embroidery needle 
for that. And then, of course, this the uh, best uh, instructions, you uh, get a brochure in here that will give you all of the instructions to tell you how to make this. And you can make these blocks. This is what it's going to look like, depending on whether you make just a couple blocks or a bunch of blocks. It's what you can make with that. So very handy and a very, very easy and good way to learn your embroidery machine is to use the perfectly pieced subscription. Ah, again, a fan of Fat Quarter Shop, we have February's Sew Sampler. This is a great subscription to get if uh, you're just building your stash. I, When I first started quilting, I was subscribed to this. I've stayed subscribed to it, and I just love it. It's got so many cool things in it. So I'm behind the power curve. They released the, the video on what this was back in February. I was in the hospital that day, so didn't do it. But here we go. This is February's So Sampler, and the back of the card has a coupon for 25% off Butter Churn Basics, which is very cool. You, um, It's got a code there that you can do. And <clears throat> the theme is Trending Tradition, and you get a card that tells you everything that is in here and explains everything about it. You get a beautiful, it looks like it's 20 Quiet Grace by Kim Deal for Henry Glass Company. Just a beautiful little jelly roll. It's a little mini one. I think that's 20. I don't think that's 40. It doesn't have the heft of 40. You get a Vivilux light for your sewing machine. Very handy. Very, very handy. <laughs> for these old eyes, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. I appreciate that, Sandy. You're very thoughtful. Thank you. And you got a set of number 10 quilting needles. Okay, number 10 quilting needles and a spool of Guterman. I don't know what weight this is. Let me see. I cannot tell. Guterman thread. That's a beautiful, like a copper, butterscotch copper. It's just gorgeous. And a pattern to go with it called Thick and Thin. Look at that. It finishes at 39 by 42 and a half. Beautiful. Just lovely. And if you're uh, following along and making the pressed flowers quilt, I know my friend Candace is, uh, you got the Cosmos block to put that in. This is going to be beautiful on point. Beautiful quilt. So that's a very cool little way to, you know, build up your stash get little uh, notions you normally would not, and get a discount while you're at it uh, by using the codes available to you on the back. Also, I want to let you guys know, um, the folks at Me Time, which is Machine Embroidery Time, that's who puts out the Perfectly Pieced and the Collectible Christmas. They have started a third subscription, and it is called Hoop Studio. So this is you're going to get a project every month to do a full in the hoop something. Okay. It's just adorable here. They've got a bag. They've got, um, a cute little towel that you can make. They have little, um, are the, what are those? Those are little, um, plant. I don't know what those are. I don't know what those are. <laughs> it's called hoop studio and it is a new one that they have sponsored out of the me time world. So they've got a third subscription this way. So on the perfectly pieced, you're making these blocks and you can turn them into something nice every month. This one, you're gonna come away with an actual thing, gift, project, whatever, very cool. So I think that's really neat. Another thing that the Fat Quarter Shop came out with, I gotta show you guys, these are so cool. Where'd it go? I got too much stuff here. These are called cloth biddies. And I was like, what is that? These are pretty neat. So they, they are designed to hold rolls of cloth, okay? They're magnets. And it's got kind of a stretchy little plastic rubber thingy <laughs> to hold them together. And they just, they'll hold your stuff together. But I saw this because I fold all my fabric around comic book boards, right? But I saw this and I thought, stabilizer, yeah, pretty neat. This has been on here now for three or four days and it's holding tight. So 
These are pretty cool. And they'll hold to whatever size you happen to have. So that's pretty neat. Cloth biddies, they are called. Check that out. That is exactly what those are. And they are designed to go around rolls of fabric. It's pretty cool. Okay, and last but not least, in the world of subscriptions. So, Creative Notions Quilt Shop. I've been showing you guys their stuff for years, right? I've been doing this, I don't know, three or four years for them. Love all of their stuff. So, they used to do a monthly box. And then, starting in 2024, they went to an every other month box. And the price went up a little bit but it's every other month, so you're spending less money overall. This new box came in. This is the first one for 2024, and it is so stinking cool. I gotta show you guys what's in here. You get a paper that tells you the value of what's in the box is $139 worth of product that's in here. So let's go through and take a look and see what all is here. Okay. I'm going to hold this for last because this is pretty neat, but you get a make it mini and you're going to get a make it mini. Thank you, Didi. That's very thoughtful. That is so nice. Oh my goodness. Thank you. There was one. I, uh, this one right here. Did I say Connie Wynn? Thank you so much, my friend. That is so incredibly thoughtful. I just appreciate that so much. I'm going to be able to get some more embroidery thread. Who doesn't need more of that? Right? <laughs> So each month, you're, or each, every other month, you're going to get the Make It Mini. And this is really cool. So it's an individual little uh, mini quilt that you can make, okay? You get the fabric for it. You get the pattern and everything. You can make this little quilt. You're going to get one every other month. And along with that, in this month's box, you got your Ackfeld wire hanger to hang your mini quilt. So... Where is the box from? This is from Creative Notions Quilt Shop. This is awesome. I love this. I love Vicki. She has been doing this for a very long time. And uh, she puts out the nicest stuff. So this is Creative Notions Quilt Shop. Got a link to them below. But you'll get a mini quilt every other month that you can make. And this is the one with your Ackfeld wire hanger on it. It's the same. Uh, it's almost the same one. Yep. I think it is. It's this, it's this one. It's the exact same one that I have for the Kimberbell mini quilts. It's the exact same one. Hold them together with zip ties. That's a tip. <laughs> I've got black zip ties holding it all together. Okay. So that's very cool. You also got a DIY neck warmer project. Y'all, my granddaughter is making these little neck warmers. That's the one where you just sew the square up, you know, and put it in the microwave or put it in the freezer or something like that. This is a great little project to do with a grand or uh, somebody who's learning to sew. It's a DIY neck warmer, cute little project. And it comes with the fabric to be able to make it. And all of the instructions and the pattern is there. So that's very cool. That's cute, isn't it? That should make somebody happy. Yeah. <laughs> all right. And then um, you also got, who doesn't need another rotary cutter? Yay. <laughs> An Ulfa 45 millimeter rotary cutter. Love these. Ulfas are my favorite. So that was very nice. You got a little caramel sweet from a local vendor there in Utah. And let's see what else. She's got a scrap tasket, scrap tastic patterns that are in here. Uh, you're going to get three patterns this month. It's a mystery block of the month. So you get three this month and two all the rest of the months of the year. So this one has the log cabin block and you can do a scan uh, on the QR code there to see a video of how it's done. You also got the Dresden fan flower, that one in this month as well. And then we have grandmother's puzzle block. So you're going to get two patterns each month to put together for a mystery quilt and you can pick whatever you fabric at whatever fabric you want. Also, I think it's still going. If y'all go out to creative notions quilt shop, she has an online store and I, I believe also um, a brick and mortar, but she's got all yardage right now 
Um, I don't know about the big wide backs, but regular yardage, I believe, is only six fifty a yard. Y'all need to jump over there, check it out, patronize her store, please. She uh, does wonderful stuff. Okay, and then what fabric did we get this month? Ooh, can't wait, right? Just gorgeous. This is so cute. We've got little camper vans. I'm taking it apart because I want to see it. I've been waiting to see this. I've been waiting to do it with y'all. Because <laughs> this fabric, oh my gosh, what fun is this? Let's get in here and take a look. Okay, I got to hold this up because this is too cute. Oh my goodness, y'all, These. this is a half yard. Whoa, <laughs> look at that. It's a half yard. Very, very nice. All these campers are just adorable. Y'all could cut these out on your scan and cuts. Do that direct cut. That'd be cute. It's got good lines for that. Okay. Here are, here, this is a fat quarter. We've got words and lots of fun. Look at that. That is adorbs. Isn't that cute? I got a little scooter like that. We've got four different ginghams. We have mint. And then there is a beautiful little cute floral in here. Okay, we've got a blue gingham, a pink gingham, and a purple gingham. Awesome. And then we have another fat quarter of bicycles with words. So cute in pink and bicycles with words in blue. Look at all this fabric you got, you guys. Oh my gosh. And then another cute little beautiful floral on deep purple. The, this designer is, hold on a second, I'll tell you. Let me show this last one. And we've got like a pretty, pretty geometric right there. That's really pretty. It's gorgeous. So let me tell you the designer on this. Just a second, I gotta look. This is Enjoy the Ride by Greta Lynn from Benertex. So enjoy the ride, it's called. Bicycles, scooters, campers, you gotta love that. Just beautiful, beautiful stuff. And you got an inside out pattern, table topper and table runner pattern. This finishes, it tells you right there, it's a 44. So, and you've got all the, y'all, this, this is such a deal. This is such a deal. You get so much to do. Oh, and you got your background fabric right along with it, okay? This is a white on white, and it's part of the, I think it's part of the line. Pretty sure it is, because it looks like it goes with it. Just beautiful. So much to do in here. So if you are in a quilt store desert, meaning there's not one forever around you, uh, I highly recommend you subscribe to Creative Notions Quilt Shop. Their box, it's going to come every other month. And uh, so many things to do in here. I don't think you'll be disappointed. Vicki does a fantastic job with this. So very, very cool. I am certainly going to jump on this little, I'm all over these mini quilts. I feel like I can get so much done and it's finished. I mean, it doesn't take but a weekend and you can knock out this adorable little mini quilt. So look at that one. Can you see that through there? It's just a log cabin block with an applique flower. Is that applique? I think so. I might have to snap a K that, huh? <laughs> All right, you guys. So that is it. So the big, big things for today's giveaway, do a hashtag power tools, EMB, power, hashtag power tools, EMB. If you want to win the Anita's University uh, 502, this is an in the hoop uh, thing, courtesy of Linda Sunny Fox. And she gave this to me to give to you. So thank you, thank you, thank you, Linda. You're amazing. And everybody is praying for you to get well very quick. And for the quilters, we have got, uh, this is Sanctuary by Three Sisters for Moda. This is hashtag power tools. Okay. And the scroll is going across the bottom to tell you which is which. You can enter for both, but you can only win one. Valerie, would you check those other tabs and make sure that they are collecting, doing well? Good, good. Yeah. 
Am I, did I uh, spin out there a minute? I was off for a second. So while, okay. Uh-oh. That's, is that, that might be my internet and not, uh, you guys are still seeing it. So Valerie, go ahead and hit try again. Um, not working. Valerie has been, okay. Okay. Just go up in the top and type in the URL again, just streamyard.com. Just highlight the whole thing and try it again. Okay. In the meantime, while we're waiting for Valerie to get back online, we have internet gremlins, y'all. It's these kids. I need them to go back to school tomorrow. Yay. <laughs> I got to show you what she's been working on. She came in and y'all, it got buried. It got buried. Did, did you find it? Are you back? No, no, I won't lose it. <laughs> she is doing the quilted witch cross stitch. This is Valerie's work. I want to show you guys. Let's get up close and take a look. Look at this. Isn't this just absolutely beautiful? This is the uh, quilted cross stitch. Look at that. She's been working on it and she's done a great job. She's not finished with it because she's only got half her skirt. But just look, isn't that just gorgeous? How about that cat? So, and I did give away the quilted witch pattern the other day uh, when I hit the 70,000 subscribers. And so she got on. Is that just you? I think it's just you because everybody else, no one is saying that they are not on. So Valerie's internet is giving her fits. Are you back? Mm, right. I see you there, but it's not. It's not. No, it's not. Okay. I'm going to have to probably do the draw. Oh, well, it won't work, Valerie, because no, your screen it, won't show. Went yeah. So Valerie has been given the boot. Hold on here. Um, I want to do. I'm going to take over for her. We are a team here. And let me choose this stream. If y'all just bear with me a second, I need to put in the codes. Um, uh, all right. And do this one. And that's, I don't know if that's going to work. It's going to take a minute to have to pull these up and do the count again. So... Uh, I want to see, oh, you know what? I want to show you guys something really cool while we're here. I didn't mean to be on an hour, but we are uh, getting long-winded here. So, uh, Valerie, can you close, open a new browser tab over, hit the other plus, yeah, and try to go back to StreamYard.com, just up in the URL, up in the top, much, yes, right up there, StreamYard.com and see if it will let you in there. Because she's got all of the entries coming in on her computer. I want to show you guys something really cool while she tries to get back on. Um, hold on a second. I'm going to turn on this. Um, I'm going to show you my scan and cut. Did that work? It did not. Oh, that didn't work. Either. Hold on a second. We can do this. Turn this on. We've got gremlins here, you guys. Nope. That's not going to work. We'll have to do this the old fashioned way. So she's having, I don't want you in the giveaway tool. I need you on StreamYard, just the regular StreamYard. So that way um, you can share your screen and show all the winners. That's what we're after right now. Because we're fixing to pull that. Let me go and do mine again. Did you find it? Yes, that's it. Enter studio, that top one. Okay. Let's see if it'll bring you in. She is on wireless and I have, um, and you're in, you are in good. Okay. So I'm going to bring Valerie back on here. I'm going to put her on. There we go. Um, I'm going to take me out and mute you. Whoop, you. Whoop. Valerie, go ahead and share your screen. Valerie, go ahead and share your screen. With the settings. With the settings.
Ready to draw? And I think we're ready to draw. Let me remove this. Okay, we're gonna give away the Anita Good Design. Ready, set, go. And it's gonna take its peaky sweet time <laughs> to whisk through here. Oh my goodness. Okay, winner, Deb Pike. Winner, Deb Pike, thank you, that's great. So Deb, send me an email, powertoolswiththread at outlook.com and give me your mailing address and I will get this in the mail to you. Congratulations. So Deb Pike won the Anita University uh, 502. All right, so can we do, now go to the other, so stop sharing on the blue button there and go back to your stream yard. Nope, the other one, well, the one that has you. There you go. And share, uh, present, share screen, and choose the one, get. Yeah. Got it? Yep. Okay, no. And we're going to do the other one now. This is for the layer cake and the pattern. And it's going to work eventually. <laughs> it's going. Oh, if you sign in as YouTube user, you cannot win because I don't know who you are. Anybody can sign in. Oh, Maggie, yay. That's wonderful. Maggie Moore has won. So, Maggie, please send me an email, powertoolswiththread at outlook.com. Congratulations, Maggie. I think you're going to love it, and I bet you it makes a beautiful quote. All right, you guys. Let me come back on here. Thank you, Valerie. You did awesome. She's like, 